Saw that. It's a little guy. It's not the biggest one, but who makes a viche? Oh, snook. Maybe it's a moonfish. Nah, that's a moonfish. It's a big one too. Wow, hooked him. Does it count? That's a big one. Let's see if he stays on. Oh yeah. Good one, huh? Good job. It's not a good one. That one, all good ones, except for the little one. Got one. Nice big one too. It's the night of lunker moonfish. Last night we went moon fishing and it, it sucked, quite honestly. There's people driving around, singing on their boats. They're all in my way, blowing wake all over the place, scaring the fish, scaring me. And as a result, we only ended up with six moonfish. But at least they were big ones. The ceviche begins now. Let's get your up that bloodline and then just make up some uh, little chunks of fish, little bite sized morsels. That's how I like to do it. I found that this is the best ceviche meat you can get. It's firm, but not too firm. It's mild. All about texture with ceviche. So now we're gonna cover it with some lime juice. And 
and you use as much as it takes. There's no recipes. Recipes are for baking. All right, put that in the fridge. Exactly one hour or half an hour. Probably only needs like 20 minutes really to start to turn opaque. So now for the base is just basically a salsa. You got some tomatoes. And you just eyeball it all, whatever it looks good to you, looks good to me. Got some red pepper. Got some green pepper. Is it pepper or peppa? You got some serrano chilies that aren't hot at all. You got some garlic. You got some red onion. Chop up some cilantro. Then we'll season that up. I give it a little oil to kind of bring it all together. Some lime juice. Pineapple would be good in here. That's it. We'll let that sit and we'll combine them together when the fish is done. How it looks when it's done. We got a little salsa here. Ceviche salsa. And then we're just gonna mix in our fish. I could put all the juice in there. We'll see how it looks. We'll give it a stir. It needs some more juice. It's got some good lime juice in there. We're gonna do a, I like to top it off with some orange juice. Uh, exactly that much. Well, that looks good now. Orange juice gives it a little sweetness that I happen to like. A couple of saltines. A little scoop on there. That's it. It's perfect. It's light, it's fresh. First you can taste the fish and the lime and the tomato and the green pepper and the salt and the onion. It all comes through and it hits you. It's not spicy. I like it spicy. What are you gonna do?